So, it's time to get touchy. <laughs> what do I mean by that? I mean that when uh, you're up close and personal with an opponent, keep your hands on, keep tactile. In other words, just keep doing what you can to keep your hands in the person's face or anywhere because when you're in a fight, I don't know how many of you have been in a fight, but when you're feeling that person on you, it might not even be a hard punch, you know, but it's some form of contact, it distracts the mind, yeah? That person is distracted, they get frustrated, you know, it's, uh, it's like someone poking you in the face, okay? So what I'm trying to say is, if I'm here and we're, you know, he's thrown a punch and I've blocked it, now when I punch, when I punch it, I'll put my hand on there, I'm keeping that hand there until I can come with another strike. See that? So my hand was there, come with the elbow. Now this hand will grab his head until I come with another elbow, and then etc. Yes, I'm always. My hands are always on this person, okay? Creates, again, frustration, and the person, it, well, it sort of prevents them from striking back um, accurately and with precision, okay? If I just do this, if I'm here, he throws a punch, I block it and I, I might hit him. I don't hit him that hard, I go pow, and then I'm back here, he's gonna throw another one. And then we're like exchanging blows, like tennis. What for? Waste of energy, one of you's gonna get tired, you know? And then it's just, it's just a waste of time, okay? So instead of exchanging blows, I'm gonna come in. Ooh, 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 ooh. going to carry on blow after blow after blow until I get that final one I might push his chin right back boom get him straight in the throat that's it okay I might get him here and chop him straight here straight out there got his head again here boom got his head again here bam. got him I'll keep my hand hold on his arm bam straight through Oh, knee strikes. My hands are always making some sort of contact. Understand? Hope that makes sense. <laughs> Keep your hands on the person, okay? Another reason why as well is for safety. What do I say safety? I'm talking about his safety, not mine. Okay? A lot of the times when people get killed in a fight, it's not because the person hit him so hard. It's because... The person hit them, they then fall back on the floor, crack the back of the head on the concrete or on a curb and die. Okay, that's how a lot of people die in a fight. It's not because of the strike. So, what I'm trying to say is this, if I do throw that punch because I'm being tactile, bam, I'm catching him. I can't prevent him from dropping, but also leading myself up to my next strike. So it serves two purposes. Crack, crack, boom. Yes? Bam, boom. Rotate, grab, headbutt, boom, elbow, boom. It all flows. It's like water, it's like a chain. Yes, we carry on, okay? The only time this person's gonna drop is when he falls downwards and I'm gonna support him, okay? I don't wanna kill anyone, okay? I don't wanna be in jail. Or manslaughter, okay? So it helps that as well, okay? If you keep your hands on, you're in control of this person. I'm controlling him, okay? I'm controlling where he goes. I'm controlling where I hit. I'm controlling if he's gonna fall or if I'm gonna hold him upright, okay? That's it. So again, hope that makes sense and it means something to you and you can use it, okay? And um, yeah, might not make sense to you, but it makes sense to me. So guys, thank you again for listening, okay? Uh, look after yourselves, look after each other. Be happy, be nice. We're only here once. Okay, make the most of it. Take care, guys. <laughs>